Yo, what is going on guys? Toto here. Now today I'm gonna be showing you how to download the mod menu for BO2 Zombies. Now the first thing that you're gonna wanna do is go right ahead on this link. The Both the links are gonna be down in the description below to get the, to download these things. But anyways, what you're gonna wanna do is press download. It's gonna do something. <clears throat> Just have to wait. And boom, there we go. Set up a GC Studio. Okay, open when done. Press yes. Pick your language. Next. Now browse where the hell you want to put this. I'm gonna put it on programs. Programs. There we go. Next. Create desktop. I think that's optional, but I suggest doing that. It basically puts like a. It over here, if nobody needs that. Anyways next and install boom now you just gotta wait and finish boom there it is but don't go in it just yet <clears throat> the second thing you're gonna want to do is go in this link that's also gonna be down in the description below now you're gonna want to go on this link and hit the download button I'm just gonna wait you X out of this whatever you open this and oh yeah you open you open that with any app press x out of that now what you're gonna want to do is drag this the one five pc over here x out of this go in your folders go on anywhere you want documents downloads i'm gonna put it on downloads and I'm gonna put it over here boom there it is 1.5 PC. Now you're gonna X out of that. <clears throat> now you don't need Google anymore, so we're gonna X out of this. What you do need, though, is to go in GCS Studio. Now the first thing you're gonna wanna do is open Black Ops 2 in your PC. Of course, you wouldn't be doing this if you didn't have Black Ops 2, so you know. Now the next thing I'm gonna do is go in Black Ops Black Ops 2 and hit the online button. Now, I'm just gonna um, lower the sound because we don't want to hear that in the video. Now, you go back to GCS Studio, boom. This is the one. You go and connect, okay? You press PC, attach the current Steam process, okay? Boom. And it's gonna say this, success. Uh, attach to success. If Black Ops 2 is not uh, open and uh, you didn't press online, it's not gonna work. This happened to me last time like I was like wondering why and I had I didn't have Black Ops 2 open so you remember you have to open Black Ops 2 anyways after you've done this you can check do it again yeah see there's a tick here boom do it again whatever okay now you go on create a project boom you name this whatever you want I'm gonna name it Zom zombies and you gotta be really careful select zombies don't select multiplayer it's not gonna work and what you're gonna wanna do is put a random name okay I'm just gonna put that yeah, I didn't put zombies because that one already existed, so yeah. Next thing you're going to want to do is hold, first of all, press. Press your left click your button, your mouse. Press control A, delete everything. Now, you're going to go in editor again. Don't go and create project or any of this. Go down to inject and uh, completed file scripts, okay? Add GCS to inject. Now, you see this MP. Go back over here and here, you're gonna see the 1.5 PC. Double click on that and you click once on this. If you click, you see, this is where the MP came from. Do not inject the MP, inject the, the maps, okay? Select folder, inject list. Now, um, you minimize that. I'm not sure if you can close that thing, but just, you know, minimize it. Now, let me put my sound back up. Now, what you want to do is go on any game. I don't know if you can get banned uh, by using this, but you know, I suggest not going to uh, online lobby unless it's with your friends, you know? If you, you know, need to put your friends in online lobby, don't do that. But anyways, I'm gonna prove to you that the mod menu actually works. As you can see, welcome to Project Icon Iconic, blah, blah, blah. Press F and aim, okay. So basically what you're gonna do is aim your weapon and uh, whatever knife button you have, just use it, bam. 
here are all the mods boom you know what I'm gonna put God mode on and I'm gonna go right in the fire boom it's not killing me infinite ammo boom, 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 boom. see infinite ammo right there basic forge you can uh, oh yeah wait basic forge mode that's um, for a different thing you go back but anyways no clip I'm not sure how this one works I think you have to enable flight or something but anyways toggle third person mode and yeah oh my god my aim is really bad <laughs> oh my goodness bro imagine playing like this though anyways toggle aim bot to which him <laughs> oh, oh my god <laughs> yo that is OP anyways health bar you can see your health bar I think that's your health bar oh I think it's cause him you have God mode on. Let, let me let, let me disable God mode. Wait, no. E. Disabled. Oh, yeah, there we go. Oh, that's pr that's actually really helpful. As you can see, the damage. Oh, it doesn't do that much damage actually. You can like really see how much damage it does. Anyways, let me see how much one zombie does. I want to see how much one zombie does. Come on, boy. Yeah, half damage. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> half damage. You can see one damage does half damage. Now what you want, what you can do after is just go on. No, go back on personal mods to give yourself perks. You go all the way down. Perks menu, boom. You give yourself armor vest, which is juggernaut, and boom. Now when a zombie hits you, the bar is gonna go only. Yeah. Just a third kind of, a third of the way. What? What was that? Oh, the aim bot, yeah. As you can see, this is overpowered. Like, I don't know. I think the aim bot also toggles insta kill. Because, like, one headshot doesn't really kill zombies on land. Two. Maybe if they're on fire, but anyways. Yeah, yeah, it also, uh, it, can, it also gives you wall hacks. You can basically end the round super easily like this. Super easy. Just keep spamming your weapon and slap infinite ammo on, and boom, there you go. Get all your perks and go to around 100 or something. You can also get infinite jet gun. You can, you guys can explore the rest of the mods. I'm not gonna ruin the phone for you. But yeah, like weapon mods. You can give yourself any weapon. Zombies menu, power ups menu. Let me see what the zombies menu is. Boom. Yeah, spawn all zombies. Oh damn. There's only oh okay <laughs> don't want to do that anyways you can teleport all the zombies to your crosshair boom keep doing that and yeah that's that's crazy oh <laughs> yeah just yeah anyways make all crawl toggle zombies oh oh jesus you're just gonna crash your game i think so don't do that <laughs> you can do no heads i think that instantly kills them all or maybe just removes their oh oh never mind it, it just um yeah it just removes their heads you can change the run speed walk oh you can make them run oh okay you can make them sprint you can make them super sprint which i don't recommend and i highly i mean highly don't recommend bus sprint like like bus sprint is just mad should i do it guys i think i should do it wait do i have god mode on i don't know if i've got mode on and wait did i activate bus sprint i don't i don't think i did wait boom done oh good oh my goodness bro yeah as you can see you can basically do anything with this mod you can also build, I think it's a forge menu and after, yeah, you can, boom, basically put doors everywhere. Okay, you can build your own freaking map, origins, boom, tag origins, know what the hell that is. Um, okay, well, that's something, that's weird, but uh, yeah, boom, 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 boom. You can obviously, you can't walk through the doors, but I think those are viable doors. Anyways, yeah, uh, wait a minute. 
Oh, you can you can move where you want to place it by by like by aiming at them, and you can what? Oh, I understand what forge menu does. Now I really understand. Basically, what it does, it lets you move items. And oh my god, this is so overpowered. Yeah, boom. Now watch. Or maybe it doesn't let you move items. Yeah, that's weird. That's really weird. Maybe you have to press E or something. Oh my god, but anyways, yeah, that, that's pretty much it, guys. Thanks for watching, and yeah, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications, and go subscribe to my other channel. I leave that down in the description below, and share the video. And yeah, I'm gonna see you next time, guys. Thanks for watching.